I'm Katie and I'm here to show you how to get the most from your Wi-Fi connection. Signal strength is key, after all you want ultra fast broadband. Ideally put your router in the highest, most central location for all users, though we understand this won't always be possible. And remember, if you're going to be using hardwired connections you'll need to plan where the cables are going to run. Lots of things can interfere with your Wi-Fi signal. Bluetooth devices, fluorescent lighting, microwaves, thick walls, and even fish tanks. Every obstacle between you and the router could weaken the signal. However, your Hytron router has what's called dual concurrent Wi-Fi. This means it can broadcast two frequencies, 2.4 gigahertz and five gigahertz simultaneously. For the fastest speeds, choose five gigahertz. Unfortunately, not all devices can find it, usually due to older technology, but they can still use the 2.4 gigahertz. When you're searching for a network, you'll see all available SSIDs or network names within range. Find the one matching the label on the back of your router and use your password to connect. And sometimes you might need to connect using Wi-Fi protected setup or WPS. For example, if you're connecting a printer to the modem. To do this, you'll need to enable this feature in the interface and use the button on the front of the modem. Finally, if your Wi-Fi is running slowly, your wireless channel could be congested. Changing channel can often help improve performance. There are loads of downloadable apps showing visuals of the congestion. If you do want to try changing channel manually, we'd only really recommend channels one, six, or 11. The others can be troublesome. And if you don't, simply reboot the modem and it'll automatically refresh to the least congested. I hope this has helped. If you need anything else, why not check out our help and support pages? Or for more information, talk to us on live chat.